So Lucid Motors has been very talked about these past days and we are all waiting eagerly to see whether they will be going public through a reverse merger with Churchill Capital or CCIV stock. Now I've gotten some great news about whether this merger will happen and I want to go through all the signs that this is in fact happening, which by the way would make this stock double or triple just like that in my opinion. I will end this video with giving you my own approach to this investment and also what share prices I can see CCIV stock getting to if the merger with Lucid Motors actually does go through. So stay tuned guys. So to give a quick backstory, Lucid Motors is just an awesome, promising electric vehicle company with former Tesla executives working there. They have a very advanced technology and have progressed quite far when it comes to scaling and manufacturing. Just last month, completing the construction of their $700 million factory in Arizona to really ramp up production. With the initial capacity to deliver 30,000 vehicles in 2021 and much higher in the next years to come, just imagine how much confidence this company has that they will be making tons of sales this year. But guys, until now they have been private, but we are at this point sure that they will be going public and start selling stock. They have even sent out job requests to hire investor relations staff and also an SEC reporting manager. Stuff you only need to do if you are planning to become a publicly traded company. With this established, there are a plethora of signs that they will be going public using a so-called special purpose acquisition company such as Churchill Capital. These guys basically merge with Lucid Motors and since they are a publicly traded company, that will make Lucid also a publicly traded company. This is a quite efficient way to go public since most of the work has already been done by Churchill Capital. And when people started thinking that this merger would happen, CCIV stock or Churchill Capital went from $10 a share all the way up to $18 a share because obviously people think Lucid Motors should be worth a lot of money. And if the merger will happen, that means that they are essentially buying stock in Lucid by buying CCIV. So why do we think that this merger will happen in the first place? There are a bunch of reasons with the last news being very very recent. The first one that started it all was Bloomberg who reported that the founder of Churchill Capital, Michael Klein, is in talks with Lucid Motors to take them public pretty much. And as you can imagine, Bloomberg is not one to randomly spit out things that might be wrong. In these SPAC cases, they're probably right around 90% of the time, so just that is strong evidence in my opinion. But aside from that, there are just way too many connections to be found and even another private independent source that I will get into last. But guys, these connections begin with Saudi Arabia. Saudi Arabia's public investment fund owns more than half of Lucid Motors as they bought more than a billion dollars worth of shares back in 2018. But wait, guess who is an important advisor to this public investment fund? That's right, founder of Churchill Capital, Michael Klein himself. But wait, there is more. Andrew Liveris, who happens to be chairman of the Lucid board of directors and operating partner at the CCIV board, is also a special advisor to Saudi Arabia's public investment fund. Just look at this graphic made by El Professor on Twitter showing all the connections between these two companies. It is much easier to show it to you instead of explaining all the connections one by one. But on top of all this, we have a PitchBook Data, a software as a service company that delivers data research and technology covering the private capital markets. And they just updated their page on Lucid Motors showing that they have an upcoming reverse merger deal, guys. And lastly, we have Alex Cutler on Twitter who has researched this case thoroughly and even talked about how Lucid Motors plans to go public quite soon with a tight deadline. And in that case, a reverse merger is the absolute fastest way to do it. And just hours ago, he said that this merger is absolutely happening and you can't deny it. 
So with all this evidence, I am convinced that Churchill Capital and Lucid Motors are at least in talks right now. But that doesn't necessarily mean that they will come to an agreement, right? Well, according to SPACtrack.net, 87% of all companies that are in talks like this end with a definitive agreement. So basically actually merging. So how am I personally playing this spec and do I think CCIV stock will be worth or is worth investing in right now? Well, if it wasn't obvious already, I absolutely think it is. Even though I acknowledge the risk, guys, in my personal opinion, there's something like 80 to 90% chance of this merger going through, which would lead to Churchill Capital maybe doubling or tripling in share price very, very quickly. So 40 or $50 a share would not be out of the cards at all. But if the merger doesn't happen, however, which is quite unlikely in my opinion, that would still only make CCIV stock going back down to $10 a share. So not even dropping 50%. And honestly, if this happens and you decide to just hold the stock, the chances are quite high that they someday find another company to merge with and the share price will bounce up back again. So yes guys, I think this is a great opportunity, which is why I am personally in CCIV stock right now with a small amount of my portfolio. No matter what you do, always stay diversified, own many different stocks with different risk levels, so you always spread your risk. It's so important, especially when investing into SPACs like CCIV. And of course, even though I just presented my case for this thing going through, remember, I'm not a financial advisor, this is not financial advice, so please do your own research and come to your own conclusions before investing your hard-earned money in the stock market. And with that, I want to conclude today's video. If you are new here, by the way, my name is Sam and welcome to this channel. Here I talk about the various different growth stocks that I think have tons of potential for the future and will basically do big things. And obviously, I think Lucid Motors is one of those companies. It is an electric vehicle company that I think will do tons of disruption in the future. Anyways, if you like this particular video, then please press that like button. It is the absolute best way you can support me and it helps the video reach out to more people. Also, if you watched all the way to this point and if you enjoyed this content, of course, very important, then please make sure to subscribe to the channel as well and press the notification bell so you never miss another upload. Guys, we are almost closing up on 15,000 subscribers and I'm just so thankful for all your support. We're growing faster than ever. Lastly, thank you as always for watching the video and I will see you in the next video. Bye.